Hunger in Guatemala by Kylie. In the country Guatemala, there are starving children because our country, well, some people, are selfish and cruel. They don't care about starving kids. All they care about is themselves. Compared to them, we are rich. We have houses, food, and we have access to medical care. They don't. We need to help them or do something. I'm 100% positive they would trade lives with any one of us. And some kids can't go to school, and the fee is only $1 to go. Now tell me that's sad they can't even go to school for $1. Every minute a child dies from measles, pneumonia, and AIDS. We get vaccinated for that. They don't have the money. And 100 boys get to go to primary school and only 83 girls. You might see some pictures of children in Africa or Guatemala have huge stomachs. It is not from them eating too much. It is from them not eating enough. It is called malnutrition. And this can cause kids to die. They even have to eat crumbs off the ground. We need to do something. You could go to the dollar store and buy some cheap school supplies or get canned food and find a way to get it to Guatemala or Africa. Anything helps. We need to help. If you want to help but can't help a different place, you can start by helping your neighborhood. Believe it or not, there are people that don't have a job or a home. You can help just by giving a smile. It can make their day. Every minute a person dies in Guatemala because they don't have access to medicine, food, education, or even a home. That is why I think we should do something. If you want to help, you could go to a soup kitchen and help the people who don't have homes or food to eat. You can cook for them. If we don't, if we don't the whole Guatemalan country could go extinct. The population is very low because they're all dying all at once.